Well, what's going on, everyone? Welcome back to Retails, coming to you from my green love seat with the homie, Shelf. I'm your host, Travion Prince. So today, I want to take you back in time. So it's paint a picture for you. It's 2008 at Sacramento State University. The dining commons have been turned into an auditorium in which the student talent show is going to be held for a freshman or just anyone who lives on campus. Um, Cause we just needed more ways to bond with each other. I even busted out this old hoodie to help get you guys back into the mood. Anywho, so as I'm sitting there, there's this kid who's singing a beautiful ballad. It's a French and Frank Sinatra song. And I was like, wow, he's doing a really good job. But in my mind, I was like, I really have to pee. So I think, okay, how can I get out of this situation without disrupting the performance? Cause that was what I was really concerned with. Um, I got up and I bent over. You know how you kind of like hunch over like, like, like that to try to, you're not like blocking everyone's view. Mind you, there was no one sitting behind me, so I don't know why I hunched down. But I decided to walk to my right and there was like 15 empty seats. But if I had gone to my left, there were four people sitting in a chair. So logically, you should have gone to the left, but I was like, well, I don't want to interrupt their view. They were actually enjoying it. So I went to the right. Um, and as I'm walking, I'm thinking, this is a bad idea. I'm going to trip over my own feet like I tend to do on a regular basis. And um, I trip over. Sure enough, I land in some chairs. And I don't just, like, fall. But I, like, fall, tumble, and cascade into a trash can. So, like, I took out the whole row. And then I also slammed into this trash can, knocked the trash can over. No garbage got on me. So, you know, I didn't need a tetanus shot or anything. But I was like, wow, wow, way to go, Trey. So as I'm sitting there, paralyzed with embarrassment, I'm thinking, you know, if they can't see me, then it didn't happen. Kind of like, you know, in Jurassic Park, when they say, if you don't move, the T-Rex can't figure out where you are and you'll be okay. Well, I thought that was real, so I did it in my own life. It's not, just so you all know, it, it doesn't exist. So as I'm sitting there, Lying still, perfectly still, I noticed that my friend who was sitting next to me laughed so hard that he fell out of his chair, subsequently throwing his hand back, hitting someone in the chest. So they were like, oh, it just was like a domino effect. It just, it, it wasn't just one train wreck, it was several. So, you know. And then what made it really fun was that uh, the young man who was performing decided to... I guess lend a hand and he stopped his song, looks over and goes, are you okay? You good? And then by that point I was like, foot! So I was like, well, they all know I fell. I can either run out of here and cry or I don't know what to do at this point. So I just stood up and I took charge, took charge and took ownership and I said, you know what? It was me. Hi. Yes. Thank you so much. <laughs> I was part of your entertainment for tonight. Please enjoy and stay, enjoy the crudite. And you know what? There's a meet and greet session later. We'll be good, you know? So I just played with it. I did end up bolting out of the uh, cafeteria as fast as I could because I still had to pee, but I also was like, I can't bear to look at anyone right now. I was already like kind of awkward and I was like, now I'm awkward and I fell in front of everyone. So this is just a great way to start off my freshman year of college. Um. Yeah, no one remembered that, but it did help me not to be so uh, afraid to go up and talk to new people because I figured everyone knew who I was from this incident. So I was like, well, you know what? Hey, now you get to know me. I made some great friends. For, uh, weirdly, though, I'm the only one who remembers that. Oh, well. So if you have a story like that where you've fallen, you've done something embarrassing, don't be ashamed. Just know that we all do it and know that you can bounce back from it like I did. And if you want to see more of my shenanigans, tune in on my Instagram, Trey underscore Prince 14. And then from here on out, please leave a comment, leave a like, tell me what you think, share your story, because you know what, if we all share our stories, then we won't feel so bad about doing really funny stuff that we could use to entertain the masses via YouTube. All right, everyone, tune in every week to get your last right here. And remember, peace, love, and palm trees.